Hello everybody, welcome back to the channel and uh, Merry Christmas to you all and I hope that you all have a pleasant one and a Happy New Year. Well today I got for Christmas this lovely little cylinder Bluetooth speaker made by Goodmans who have been making products for many years and this is called a Bluetooth Moonlight Speaker and uh, for those of you who can see what it's like it's like a cylinder shape and um, you're seeing at the moment the uh, front view but if I turn it upright the speaker is on the top and there's also like a touch pad as well which I will show you um, a bit later on and so what we'll do is we'll take a look at some of these buttons here um, on the front from left to right and they are there are five little tiny square buttons i don't think i'll be able to get them all on camera but i'll try and explain to you as best as i can uh, what they are uh, from left to right uh, you have got your turn on and off switch for the light and that means that whilst the light um, is on or your color is set if you press that it'll toggle on and off the touchpad so that you can't control the touchpad if it's sort of turned on i think that's the way it works if it's if it's turned on or off it'll activate and deactivate the top then beside that you have got your previous track stroke rewind button for playing back music and that also, if you press and hold, that acts as your volume button, so you can turn down your volume. And then the third from left is your play and pause button, which will play and pause music. And also, if you're answering an incoming call, you can press it to answer a call if you have your phone connected. And if you want to reject the call, you simply press and hold that button. Now, beside that, the fourth button is your fast forward stroke volume down button and the same thing applies you press it once to fast forward through your tracks on your phone or mp3 player or press and hold to increase the volume uh, so the rewind uh, decreases the volume and the fast the uh, fast forward one increases the volume and then the last button um, is your mode button so you can press that to toggle between bluetooth mode or ft card mode which is like an sd card uh, except it's very very small because you can play a wee card full of mp3s as well or you can toggle between that and line in so you can also connect like an old system to it as well if you wanted to so looking at those buttons we will turn around and swivel to the back of the unit here and there are what do we see one two three uh, three ports there you've got uh sd card slot there for your ft card around around 3.5 millimeters jack for your line in so you can connect an mp3 player that doesn't have bluetooth to it and then the other slot is the usb slot which is a micro usb slot for charging your device and then if we turn and have the bottom um, of the unit there is if i turn around this where the buttons are face on the top on the side and then on the bottom here is a switch a power switch and you flick it on with your nail power on. like that there and then 
the other way turns it off. So there you go. So what we'll do is we'll get this thing switched on now and I'll come back to you shortly with a short demonstration. Well, hello, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome back to part two. As you can see, I've got the unit switched on now. And there are seven, seven different colours. So if I, what I was seeing now, if I press the, the first the button here, it's a bit hard to do this one-handed. Hopefully now that made it, I'm not sure if that's turned on and off the thing. I'll just touch it and see. Yes, that's turned off the, the touch pad on the top. So if I press that again, the first button that I was telling you about. And now we'll try and touch the thing on the top. Oh yes, off. There's about three different settings for brightness and then off. So we'll turn it at its brightest. And if I press and hold for two seconds on the touchpad, that's off. And then you've got your colors. Um, I'm touching it there and it's changing. Uh, I think that's, it's a bit hard to see it, to be honest with you, um, in the light here of the room, but there's red and there's purple and green and blue and alternative. And it's, as, as, as I, cha as I touch the thing, it's changing colors. And you can set it to whatever color you want. I thought it automatically changed colors, but I, I'm not sure if you can. I thought I'd seen it doing that earlier, but what do we see what color will we'll change it to a nice. Oh, that's like a, that's red. We'll change, we'll change it to like blue. If I can. Well, that's like a sort of a purpley color, but that's, that's nice. So what we'll do is, um, I forgot to say that underneath at the bottom, there's also indicator lights to tell you when it's charging, if it's lit up, it means that it's charging. So I've got something from the, I've got um, connected actually my MP3 player already because there's a button you can press. If you, I press the mode button that I was telling you about, which is the last one on the right, the bottom. Bluetooth mode. Oh, that's Pairing. Connected. So it's already found and connected to my MP3 player. So if I press play, I've got something from the audio YouTube library here. That's a bit. What do you see now? It's not going to work now. Six twenty one p.m. Charge. Well, I might have to actually um unlock it. Um, I'll come back to you. I'll come back to you in a wee second. Okay. Well, I've got this connected now. So if I press play, I'll let you hear what it sounds like.
and turn the volume up, up a wee bit. changing colors now so it is you have to set it to I think it's alternative and I can see now that it's actually you can now skip this ad it's hard sort of to see it on here on the camera to be honest um but it is changing so you can set it to an alternative That's just some stuff from the audio YouTube library to avoid copyright. Anyway, there you go, folks. I hope you've enjoyed this short demonstration of this Goodman's Bluetooth speaker, this Moonlight speaker, and uh, that you can connect as well, as I say, uh, a line and cable to it so that you can hook up uh, another device without bluetooth and as i've already said you can use an ft card but i'll not bother demonstrating any of those um at the moment as some of them are self-explanatory but i just wanted to give you an idea of the sound so hope you all have a good evening and enjoy your day and i'll talk soon bye bye